What's up, Gemini gang? What's happening? I hope you guys are doing well. I appreciate you for being here. Of course, I say that every video. Um, let's see what's going on. All Gemini placements take the resonates. Leave the rest. Take it how it resonates with you and your situation. If you need a personal reading, check the description box. I believe there's only a few one-question readings left. There are no more two-question readings. I did check it last night. Um, so, yeah, that's it. That's everything. All right, hit those likes, hit those likes, hit those likes, you guys. Hit that subscribe. I appreciate you. Of course, I just saw this on the bottom of the deck. Wow. Okay, so this is a, a lighter energy than I have, I've seen for you guys <laughs> lately. Uh, so, uh, I, I kept seeing the Empress card for you when I was shuffling. Um, so, okay then. All right. Let's see. We have love call here. This is expressing love. Messages of love. Thinking of you and informing you. Okay. So, someone may call you, text you, say they're thinking about you. We have hammer, which is sabotage and rebuild. Persistent. Working on it and repairing. This is giving eight of pentacles vibes. We have the Cupid's arrow. This is half faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation and struck by love. And then we have paradise here, which is happiness and joy, playfulness, enjoying each other and honeymoon phase. So some of you guys may be getting out of a, uh, out of a tough space with uh, the person on your mind. No matter how long it's been going on, someone's going to come in treating you better with this Empress card. This could also be you learning or needing to learn how to treat yourself, okay? Because people ultimately are going to treat you how you treat you. Um, Gemini's, okay? So I feel like this could be um, someone kind of coming in and kind of treating you um, better and seeing your worth and everything because some of you may have started to see your worth and you stopped um, engaging in things that, that don't align with that, okay? So... Of course, when you do the work, it's going to reflect on the outside. All right. So, yeah, I'm liking the energy so far. So we'll see, though, because, you know, spirit takes us for a loop sometimes. But I feel like there's somebody here that wants to fix y'all's connection. Fix whatever happened. Yeah, the fool. Start over. Three of swords. Some of you, you're not talking to this person or there's like some type of there's some silence between you two right now. So I feel like, um... In this aspect, Three of Swords with the Fool is someone that just wants to talk, like like going for it, um, despite what could happen. You know, for some of you, you may have told this person to kick rocks, never talk to me again, never contact me again. Uh, three of Pentacles, yep, Six of Cups. Mm -hmm. Someone, this is definitely someone wanting to reunite. You are going to reunite with somebody if that's what you want, uh, Gemini's. You are going to reconcile with somebody. Someone wants wants to have this. I'm seeing like a, a communication and a compromise and, and trying to meet each other halfway and all that good stuff. Um, three, uh, not three, two of wands here on the bottom. There could be a planning stage going on or this has been going on if you haven't heard from this person for quite some time. Yep, page of pentacles. I'm seeing a date for some of you. Yep. Four of Wands, yeah. Some of you guys are going to get, um, I don't know, some of you guys may be getting axed out today by someone. May even be like a new person. I don't know why I got that, child. <laughs> some of you are going to set up a date with somebody today. Um, yeah, it may not be with this person, maybe with somebody else, but uh, yeah, some of you are going to uh, set up a date for this weekend. Some of you are going on a date this weekend. Mm-hmm. Tell me about it. <laughs> Email me and tell me how it goes. Uh, but yeah, I do feel like you, um, person on your mind is is going to want to like take you out, do things together, uh, meet up and talk if you haven't seen them in, in a while. Come see you. You go see them. Whatever the case may be. I'm getting a very mellow, like I'm not getting anything very extreme yet, uh, but I'm getting like a very mellow energy from this like even when I was meditating for you I felt like in high spirit so you know this person may have been feeling very down depressed it's, this could even be you too like you know you getting out of a depression um and then now you're kind of like okay I'm ready to get back out there I'm ready to you know date again or whatever the case may be the hierophant mm-hmm and then we have the five of wands so yeah I do see a, some type of communication here 
for some of you. Could be from a Taurus. Someone may say that they believe that y'all are meant to be or they believe that y'all are um, supposed uh, to be together. <laughs> but I feel like too, this could be like someone uh, having a whole new belief system. Uh, this could be also something like way out of the box as well. Like, you know, I feel like someone is doing something unconventional but conventional at the same time if that makes sense so how can i put this like say you um say you guys started off with this person or last time y'all dated or whatever you were with this person things moved really really fast and i think i've got a, done a reading like this for you guys before things move very fast and you guys skipped a lot of steps I feel like this person wants to like start over and they're going to come in in a more like traditional way, you know, like the traditional courting and things like that um, versus how they were going about it before. Like some of you, it may have gotten physical very fast or whatever the case may be. So so coming in an unconventional way to do conventional things i told you there's that five of wands again the emperor yeah somebody wanting to step up and boss up with you and like i said someone kind of like taking charge of this of the connection whereas they may have kind of took the back seat before um gemini's i'm seeing something totally different from this person like they're they're being a lot more uh hands-on and like i said um a lot more traditional that's that's what i get with this like whereas it, it may not have been like that before they they probably didn't go the the courting route or whatever um makes me wonder too if if this is like someone coming in for some of you that could be very like traditional so it would it would make sense uh you know two of Two of Wands, yeah, see, that's what I'm saying, like a, somebody playing. But this can also be about, like, somebody getting out of their comfort zone. Um, because you see he's sitting on top of this building, and he's looking down. And he's like, this, all this world out here, all this land out here. So I feel like this could be, like, someone in this, in a planning phase, or a planning stage, if that makes sense. We have the world here. Let me make sure she ain't showing nothing. Okay, yeah. And then we have the chariot and the four of swords. Yeah, someone's coming to fix, repair, whatever. So we may also have an option too. We have the king of wands here on the bottom. Uh, the chariot and the four of swords, like I said, someone getting out of their comfort zone. That's what I get with this. Like someone's willing to get out of their comfort zone for you or for this connection. Um, someone may even come by your house too, like drop by or like I said, ask like, hey, can I, can I come see you? Can I come over? Uh, can we talk? Can we meet up here at XYZ uh, or whatever the case may be because, you know, they want to talk about what's going on in y'all's connection or uh, where y'all are going with it, y'all's next steps and things like that. So I feel like you'll see like a more, um, a more stand up person than usual. And for some of you, if, if you if you're not totally interested in this person right away, they're going to be very persistent. Um, it, oh, it does say persistent on there. If you're going, they're going to be very persistent. That makes a lot of sense too. The, oh, and the emperor's under it too. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> good luck uh, getting rid of whoever this is because I feel like this person is going to be very, very, very on your ass. Okay, the empress here could be a divine pair, divine counterpart um, because. I feel like they want to fix something and I feel like they want like a fair chance um, to fix it. But yeah, I do see a reconciliation here. Some of you are going to travel or they're going to invite you on a trip too. They're going to be like, hey, you know, come with me for the weekend. Some of you, they travel for a living and they're going to like ask you to come with them um, for a job trip or something like that. But yeah, they may invite you somewhere out of town um you know even if it's just like to a new city or something like that i feel like they'll um yes y'all 
<laughs> the three of pentacles again yeah i feel like this conversation is going to be someone is getting out of their comfort zone for sure because i don't feel like this is somebody that knows how to compromise I don't feel like this is somebody that knows how to meet people halfway. It's either my way or the highway, but I feel like they're doing something different for you, Gemini's. Six of Swords here. Yeah, in order to move into calmer waters with you, in order to be in a, in a better space with you, I feel like someone's willing to meet you halfway. Um, whereas it may not have felt like that before, uh, Gemini's, it was just all or nothing with them. Like, oh, you do it the way that I want it done or this way or that way or nothing at all. And I feel like someone is willing to like compromise with you and work with you as a team, like a team effort. Could be a Capricorn. That's the three of Pentacles. Yep. Mm-hmm. We have the Hermit. Could be a Virgo for some of you um someone's lonely but i also get to that yeah there's a judgment here i'm seeing the the queen of cups and the queen of swords here on the bottom so what makes me um what makes me see that this person has really been thinking about this is now that the hermit but <clears throat> in y'all separation i feel like this person has had some time to think about you know where they are and, and as far as <sighs> This person will have a hard time communicating because as soon as I'm trying to explain this, now my mind goes blank. Um, this could be their issue too. This person may have a communication issue. Like there's a, some type of communication barrier uh, that this person has. But I feel like this person in their alone time has had time to think and, and thinking that, hey, I really wasn't that fair to Gemini or you know, I really could have done better or I really could have given more or I really could have bend it a little bit more. I could have been more flexible. And I feel like this is what, you know, someone's been thinking. But I also get a lonely vibe too. Like someone's by themselves. They may have like pushed everybody away, like um, their ways. And you may have been like the only person that like put up with them. I'm going to be totally honest. <laughs> you may be the only person that like put up with them. Um... Gemini's now I say they don't have feelings they they definitely have feelings but you know I do feel like they they have a special connection with you that's that's what I get you you're a lot more tolerant than than most uh seven of pentacles as I split the deck and yeah and they've been dealing with you for a while for some of you yeah I do get a, I do get a lonely vibe though from somebody could be you <laughs> we have a strength card here could be a leo and we have the six of cups again so like i said making memories i feel like someone wants to make new memories but also a you not a unity someone wants to unite reconcile there's that emperor again sticking out um four of pentacles here on the bottom yeah holding on to you uh holding on um <laughs> that's a song that i recently heard <laughs> so yeah i feel like gemini's you have somebody here that is going to like start showing you more affection um being a little bit more loving now th if this is a new person or a newer energy because whoever this is this is somebody you already know um i don't feel like this is new i feel like this is um i mean i don't feel like this is someone that's just coming in i feel like this is someone that's already in your energy like you can already you already know them by name and all of that <clears throat> so i do feel like um someone's like looking for like the perfect approach but i also get to that they don't want to come in like too harsh like they want to come in and be uh loving they want to come in and be uh, more vulnerable like I said vulnerable open and like I said with the strength card here I feel heavily like because sometimes the, the strength card can be about like taming the beast and I feel like you are like one of the few people that can handle this person in a nutshell and I feel like they know that and so even if y'all did separate especially if you've been separated for you know months or more you know they may have tried to date others or whatever the case may be and it just didn't work out like this person ends up alone or they feel alone no matter what's going on um and I feel like they someone misses you a lot like whoever this is uh they miss you a lot 
a whole lot. It makes sense too why we kept seeing that Empress card because I feel like, again, you your energy is very nurturing and supportive to this person, um, you know, through all their issues and all their, their nonsense. <clears throat> so you spark change in someone um, simply. So you have somebody blocked, Gemini. As soon as I split this, I see unblock me, please. <laughs> Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, shoot. It's already still popping out. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's get a couple of these handwritten. I think I'll get some letters, too. Before I get off of here. All right. I just need a few of these. I don't need a whole lot. Can we try this again? I'm telling you. I'm telling you. The distance between us is killing me. I told you. I told you. <clears throat> and even if it's just like a, a an emotional distance it doesn't have to be like you two are actually distant physically but you know i do feel like you 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 may have separated yourself from this person but that's what i get with this two of wands here like someone looking kind of far off like looking at you from a distance like you know you're kind of trying to detach yourself from this person five 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 may be significant for some of you Oh, I'm sorry. So yeah, some of you, you may get an apology. You give me butterflies. <laughs> I don't want things to end. Yeah, so they may have told you that. They may have said that, you know, they they want things to be over. They may have just acted that way towards you. I'm about to call slash text you. And that was just sticking out at me. Catching a flight. So some of you, I keep seeing that. Now some of you, this person is far away. I can't take the silence anymore. I'm telling you. It's like someone's coming in to like take charge or take a stand. Um, it's always been you. Yeah, three, three, three. That's expression, communication, all that good stuff. I feel a strong connection with you. I definitely see that. Lions, Tigers, Bears by Jasmine Sullivan. <laughs> okay, and the timing just wasn't right for us. Now that's that's the story they're going to tell. Um, but y'all know how I feel about that. <laughs> yeah. As far as the timing not being right, they may have had a lot of stuff going on in their life, and they may still do have a lot going on in their life. But that makes sense, too. Why they, this person always wanted things to be their way. That's the energy that I get with this. Someone always wanted it to be their way, their time, their schedule. Um... And I feel like now they're they're willing to compromise with you and, and meet you halfway. Let's get some uh, letters. We have C. Can y'all see those in the camera? Let me see. Yeah, I think y'all can see those. Y'all can zoom in. <laughs> J. Right. U. M. P. R. F. Hold on. C, D, Y, uh, U, Z, M, hold it on, mm -mm 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 Q, I'm going to find that song for y'all because why the hell am I singing that now? N N W. Let me uh, shuffle and get a song. I can see it. Well, no, I can't find that song right now because I don't remember who sings it. I don't remember who sings it. Hold on, y'all. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's shuffle. Uh, for You I Will by Monica. You guys, it's going to be y'all's song. All right. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe, y'all. Thank you. <gasps> Wait a minute. Before I get off of here. Now, in this song, she says, I will cross the ocean for you. And look at this picture, y'all. That's insane. All right. Let me get off of here, y'all. Thank you for watching. Hit those likes, hit that subscribe, y'all. Peace out.